Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Timmy Treacle, also known as Horror Fan for Life. And today I'm bringing you two more movie reviews. Uh, the first of which is a 1988 movie called Married to the Mob. And uh, this movie was released on August 15th, 1988. And it received positive reviews with critics. It has a 6.1 out of 10 on IMDb. 89% on Rotten Tomatoes and 88% on Google. Uh, Roger Ebert of the Chicago Sun Times, he gave this movie three out of four stars. And this movie was directed by Jonathan Demi. On a $10 million budget, it made $21.4 million at the box office, which is a mild success uh, for the 1980s. Uh, but it's got a great cast. It stars Michelle Pfeiffer, uh, Joan Cusack. Oliver Platt, Dean Stockwell, Matthew Modine, Charles Napier, Nancy Travis, and Alec Baldwin. Uh, Michelle Pfeiffer was nominated for a Golden Globe uh, for her performance in this movie. And this movie is about uh, her character, Angela DeMarco, who is married to Frank the Cucumber DeMarco. Uh, played by Alec Baldwin. Now, this is a comedy uh, crime movie. Uh, I didn't really find myself laughing all that much. Uh, to be honest, I was halfway paying attention to the movie. Uh, it, it just didn't draw me in. Not only the humor didn't draw me in, but just the characters. Uh, now... <laughs> The nickname the cucumber is, is really funny uh, and some of the other nicknames in this in this movie were funny too you have Tony the Tiger uh, played by Dean Stockwell you know but uh, I, I just didn't find this movie as funny as the critics did you know 89% of the Rotten Tomatoes I was really surprised seeing that after I watched this movie and I don't know it just it didn't resonate with me now, it may with other people, but I didn't find this movie as funny as uh, other people or other critics have. Uh, she's basically, after her husband is uh, shot and killed, uh, she goes on the run from the mob. She's trying to stay away from Tony and uh, ends up running into uh, Matthew Modine's character, uh, who's an FBI agent and uh, from there it's a typical you know crime movie uh, and it just I don't know it was just okay I didn't really I don't know I actually have more fun uh, and more laughs with the next movie I'm going to be talking about uh, but this one overall I've seen it before and I was thinking with the comedy, they would have made this like ball busting funny, uh, like a parody. And even that, it wasn't even that. It just, uh, the humor is just dull to me. Um, so I really can't say anything else about this movie because I don't want to really get into spoilers, but I don't know. It, it was just a disappointment, especially with the cast. I love the cast in the movie. Had they done this, like I said, like a parody, uh, then I think it probably would have been a lot funnier. But I don't know, the jokes didn't hit with me. Uh, I really didn't feel anything for the characters. So with that, I'm going to give uh, Married to the Mob a 6 out of 10. And that's really being generous. That's a C plus on a grade scale of A plus to F. And I'm just, you know, right in the middle of the road. So, well, I recommend that you watch this movie. I guess if you really love the actors uh, like I do. Uh, and who knows, you may find this movie funnier than I did. But I got to tell you, I have a hell of a sense of humor. And it takes a lot for me not to laugh. And, uh, yeah, it just didn't, just didn't do it for me. So, other than that, in the comment section below... Uh, let me know if you've seen this movie. Give me your thoughts and opinions. And let me know what some of your favorite parody movies are. For me, for example, I love Air.
Airplane, The Naked Gun, Scary Movie, um, Don't Be a Menace to South Central While Drinking Your Juice in the Hood. Movies like that is what I was really looking for. And just didn't get it. But other than that, I thank you guys for watching yet another movie review. Stay tuned for another movie review here shortly. And always stay tuned to my channel for top 10s rankings and other fun things. And uh, don't forget, if you're new to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Hit the bell icon. And if you like this review, give it a thumbs up. Other than that, I thank you guys for watching as always. And check you later.